Welcome to the evening Bible study. If you have the Bible, look at the book of Numbers, chapter 6, verse 22 to 27. Book of Numbers, chapter 6, verse 22 to 27. Book of Numbers, chapter 6. The Lord said to Moses, Tell Aaron and his sons, This is how you are to bless the Israelite. He says to them, The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace. So they will put my name on Israelite and I will bless them. This is the most famous uh, blessing prayer from Aaron. Aaron and his uh, children is uh, called uh, Nazareth. Nazarene. Nazarene means uh, you know, select the people. And then uh, if you look at verse 20 and 21, the priest shall then wave them before the Lord as a wave offering. They are holy and belong to the priest together with the breast that was and then tight that was presented after them. Nazareth may drink wine. And this is the law of Nazarene who bows, uh, bows his offering to the law in according to his separation. In addition to whatever else he can afford, he must fulfill the vow he has made according to the law of Nazarene. Do you know Nazarene, Nazarene is uh, this man, Aaron. Aaron is a priest uh, tribes. And the God want to use the is Aaron's uh, uh, tribes to bless uh, other tribes. And then according to the, this uh, priestly blessing, Aaron's blessing is a very, very important prayer. And you can pray according to verse 24, the Lord bless you and keep you. When you pray for people, Lord God bless them abundantly and keep them from where? From harm and dangers. Actually, this is a great blessing prayer, also protection prayer. You can pray for somebody with a spiritual blessing, even material blessing, physical blessing. You can release the blessing for others. And then pray for protection. Lord God, keep you. And the Lord God make his, shine, his face shine upon you. And what does it mean? It means presence. The Lord God be with you. Oh Lord, Lord God make his shine, shine upon you. Which means the Lord be with you. The presence of God be with you. That is meaning. And be gracious to you. The, be gracious to you. It's not wonderful. Be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace. You can receive the grace and what? Peace. Or that the Lord turn his face toward you. Same things. The Lord make his face shine upon you. Means the presence of God be with you. One of the greatest blessings in our life is the presence of God be with us. Emmanuel. Emmanuel means the Lord be with you. God be with you. This is Emmanuel. The Lord turn his face toward you. And God give you peace. Shalom. And they will put my name on the Israelite. Then you can remember the name of Jesus. And then I will bless them. Can you receive the blessing of Aaron? And you can do it for your family. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make shine uh, his face shine upon you. And he be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace. May God bless you. You can receive the blessing pray of Aaron from each other. I bless you with Aaron's blessing. And this Aaron's blessing come from, not from our own, from God of Israel, from Almighty God. Let's pray. Father, I thank you for my dear brothers, sisters. I pray the prayer of a blessing prayer, Aaron's blessing prayer. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his shine, his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless you. Have a wonderful evening and have a great week. God bless you. Bye now. Bye now.